investigation is just getting started as an overnight apartment fire forces people out of their homes in Minneapolis. Let's get right to Bill Keller live for us at the scene with what we know at this point. Good morning, Bill. Good morning. Yeah, what a contrast from one hour ago. The scene is now clear. Firefighters has left. The fire is out, but take a look at the extensive damage that was done to the exterior of this building. Now, here's what we know. The fire broke out sometime after 3 o'clock this morning, sending residents of this three-story apartment building running out into the cold. They're trying to avoid the smoke and the flames. Uh, the cause of the fire is still under investigation, but they believe it started on the outside of one of those first floor units. It quickly, though, spread to the second and third floors. The fire then raised to a second alarm. They wanted to bring in extra personnel. In fact, when we showed up, there were fire trucks and aerial ladders lined along Plymouth Avenue. Many streets closed as those firefighters worked to put out the flames. There was a Metro Transit bus that was brought in as a temporary shelter. Crews finally getting the upper hand. They stopped uh, the fire from spreading into the attic. We're told in all 11 units of this building were heavily damaged. Now the Red Cross has been called to find about 20 residents a place to stay. The uh, apartments on the affected side, the fire side, will probably not be able to be lived in for uh, some time until they get it fixed. Um, the other side... Uh, they might be able to return a little sooner. Yeah, the cause of this fire is still under investigation. Thankfully, nobody was injured. In fact, in the distance, we can still hear the smoke detectors going off, uh, likely helping everybody get out to safety. Again, the cause still under investigation. Back to you. All right, Bill.